Greetings. This is a Tesco 40 watt equivalent, actually five and a half watt, LED mini globe bulb. And the reason it's here is that it says there that it's up to 15 years of light. This is a touch over six months old and it's packed in already. It actually packed in on Saturday night. I was listening to one of um, one of BigClive.com's uh, live streams and suddenly heard this sort of uh, this strange sort of low pop and all of a sudden it was a lot darker in the room. It wasn't pitch dark because this is actually one of two, but it's knackered. So this is the box the replacement came in. So let's take a look inside and see if we can figure out what's gone wrong. There we go, that's that popped off. Just glued on. And we have not a lot. Not a lot to see. There's six LED chips in there. So they've driven it just under a water piece. Let's um, get this out and see what else is in there. Okay, that's it removed from the base. And I've traced out the schematic as well. I'll show you that in a second. These odd components here are actually connectors. The wires push through into there. So you've got this one here where the electrolytic is just pushed into place. And this then is the live and neutral. And you can see the, the live comes through a fusible resistor and that has blown. But in testing this out, you can see there's not much to it. I have discovered what else has blown as well. What you've got is three LEDs, then a resistor and a resistor and three more LEDs. Now these are actually marked for positions four and five. So this can actually be an eight LED cluster. It, the board is designed for eight LEDs. It's, it's just they've got these, these positions populated with resistors instead. And then you have this little driver chip and that's got some resistors which set the current. In fact, it's only got the one resistor. There are two positions for resistors, but there's only one fitted. And the only other thing then is the bridge rectifier. And that is actually what has gone faulty. If I test with my fluke, let's bring, let's bring that in here. I can test In one direction, you're going to come into focus, you're going to bother coming into focus. There we go. So those are both actually showing as half a volt. It was just coming up on there then. There we go. And if I turn it round the other way to do the other diode pair, there we go. You can see that one is actually a dead short. So a quarter of that diode bridge is gone and that's what's caused the whole thing to fail. Is it worth me repairing it? Not really. I've already, already ripped this thing off, off the thing. I'm hardly going to put the thing back together. I'll just scavenge what's, what's still working back into focus. I'll just scavenge what's worth salvaging off this board and chuck it in the bin. But I thought I'd, uh, I'd show you and um, so there we go. That's what's inside one of these little Tesco mini globes. That's what can go wrong with them. Hopefully what won't go wrong very often with them. Um, hope someone finds that interesting. Maybe, maybe not. Whatever. Thanks for watching.